Yes, it's right! Hello, I'm Morgan Freeman and I will be your guide to the Amaranth Corporation's new hit reality game show, SOS. Should you be lucky enough to find yourself selected as a contestant on SOS, there are a few things you really ought to know if you want any chance of survive. I mean, winning. The goal of SOS is simple. Find a relic, signal for extraction, and escape on the helicopter. She's good? She's good? She's good? The only problem is there are 16 contestants and only three seats on the helicopter. So you'll need to outthink, outrun, and outfight your opponents. We're killing everyone we see, basically. Oh, uh, yeah. Did I say there was only one problem? I lied. There are also monsters. Lots of monsters. I think I killed a dog. Now these big scary oh motherfuckers called Hoopia, and they're gonna claw you, bite you, and infect you with some crazy zombie monkey oh, virus. That time I definitely killed a dog. Right about now you might be wondering, Morgan Freeman, how the hell am I supposed to survive on a deserted island with a bunch of monsters and other desperate oh bitches trying to fuck me up and take my shit? Oh my god! Well, first of all, the nice people at the Amaranth Corporation were considerate enough to stash all sorts of knives, axes, flare guns, and pistols all over the island. And they're just waiting for you to get your grubby little hands all over them. Jesus, you're robbing that. This is somebody's Jeep. Now, don't expect that finding them will be easy. They're like spiders. There's probably something useful not more than 15 feet from you at any given time, hiding under a bush or on top of a rock somewhere. I recommend looking out for big red flags. That means there's usually a gun around somewhere. If you find a locked box, you can pick it with lock picks. Or if you got a pistol, just shoot the damn lock off. If you find a locked door, just grab an axe and chop down the door like you're in the shiny. Now, once you've found something to bash monsters with, yeah. it's time to make friends. What's up? Hey, hey, everybody. Yeah. Yeah, big old team. We are now friends. That's right. Use the power of your own voice and your bubbly personality to create bonds with other contestants nice job, and the audience. You are a beautiful woman. Oh, right. I am a woman. Sorry. I, I identify as a man. Hopefully social media hasn't stunted your emotional development so hard that you can't make friends anymore. And after you make friends, you can use your walkie-talkie to keep in touch with them. I'm in square N6. I'm on the far south end of the island. Okay. Just like the old days before fancy cell phones came out with Snapchat and Twitter and all that shit. This isn't a restore, idiot. And don't worry, kids. You can still use your emojis in SOS. Relax. After you've got your little ragtag team set up, it's time to go find yourself a relic. Look at your map for those skulls, and put your big boy pants on, cause shit's about to get real interesting. Hey Heather? Yes? Say no. I've got a gun point. Oh my god, why are you doing this? I wish I could tell you that everybody's nice and lovey-dovey in SOS. I wish I could tell you I didn't have to murder four people in cold blood so I could be here today telling you how to survive. But life ain't no fairy tale, and neither is SOS. If you do manage to get to one of those skulls on the map, you'll likely run into one of these big red hoopias with a relic on his back. They don't fuck around, and neither should you. Oh shit! I'm out of bullets! How am I out of bullets? Aim for the head, and don't forget to block, son. Nice. Oh, Lord. <laughs> now, if you get hurt, and you probably will, just find the nearest papaya tree and give it a whack a few times. Oh shit, I didn't know you could hit them. That's cool. Yeah. Mmm, mmm, papayas. Nice. Ain't no hurt a papaya can't fix. Oh, except if you get infected, papayas aren't gonna do shit. There's mushrooms for that. I'm gonna eat this mushroom in his honor. So I don't turn into a raging bee. Oh, Jesus Christ, I'm so sorry. But you better get a lot of them or else you'll start looking like Christopher Walken. Man's a damn zombie. Okay! Oh, Kay, oh why God. didn't you eat the mushrooms? Kay! Anyway, 
So you got yourself a relic. Now you're in the home stretch. Just find a flare gun, fire one off into the sky, and hop onto the nearest rescue helicopter. It's simple as that, right? Well, there's a high likelihood that your friends will betray you to get your relic. Or you'll be ambushed at the rescue site. Oh no! Or you'll be turned into raw hamburger meat by the hordes of rampaging monsters. But I guess if you're smart enough, fast enough, charming enough, and lucky enough to make it, then I guess I'll get to see you on the other side, sister. <laughs> yes! Uh, did you make it? Well, I hope you found this useful. And maybe something you learned here might save your life someday. But if you do find yourself on Lacuna Island, staring down the barrel of a loaded revolver with a familiar freckled face on the other end, don't say Morgan Freeman didn't warn you. <laughs>